In a recent video, I showed you how to use the verb make. In this video, I'll show you how to use make it. By using these two words together, you can talk about arriving somewhere, living and not dying, being successful, or changing a time or a date. Use make it when you arrive at a place on time or not on time. We made it on time. We were not late. We didn't make it on time. This means that we were late. We barely made it or we barely made it on time. That means we were not late. And we nearly made it. That means that we were late. But we almost made it. These two adverbs are the same. When a person can't attend something, then you'll hear something like this. I'm not going to make it to. And then here is the event. I can't make it to, and then here's the event. It is possible to take it off. If you do that, then take to off as well. I'm not going to make the party. I can't make the meeting. But if you use it, then you need to. Make it is similar to get through when talking about an intersection. A car makes it through an intersection. In this case, you need through. This preposition will follow make it. A car makes it through. And if you simply say, he made it, it can mean all of this, that the car made it through the intersection. A car makes it through the intersection before the light turns red. Make it through is also used for school. She made it through college in four years. It took four years to go through college. She made it through college in four years. Make it is very popular when talking about a person's success. Congratulations. You made it. He made it. He was successful. She made it in business. After the preposition in, then you have the area. You can put other fields of occupations here. Or when you refer to a specific occupation, then you can use as and then the title. She made it as an entrepreneur. Or she made it as an actress. You're going to make it. This is a good thing to say to a person to encourage work towards a goal. You're going to make it. Use make it to talk about a person's chances to live or die. He's not going to make it. This is the same thing as saying he's probably going to die. You could replace this with live, but make it sounds a little better. He didn't make it. He died. Again, this sounds a little bit better than saying 
he died. He might make it. There's a possibility that the person will not die. And he's going to make it using the going to future, talking about a person's chances for survival. He's going to make it. Make it is similar to continue or go forward. The business isn't likely to make it. It probably won't continue. It will go out of business. They won't make it. They slowly made it up the mountain. This indicates progress going forward or moving up. When changing a time, a day, or a date, you can use make it. An 11 o'clock meeting is too early. Let's make it 12 o'clock. So let's change it to 12 o'clock. Let's make it 12 o'clock. Instead of Saturday, let's make it Sunday. Let's change the day to Sunday. And finally, when someone asks you, how are you doing? You could say something like this. I think I'll make it. This just means that everything is going to be okay. I think I'll make it. This is your teacher Paul on Learn American English online on YouTube.